Hello, you're looking at a 2002 uh, Blazer with the Extreme package on it. Uh, it has a hundred and let's see, 149,000 miles on it, but it runs great. Really does, and it's a sharp looking truck. It's an automatic. All the lights are good, no warning lights on it. Has a uh, sunroof. Let's see here. There we go. I push the button the right way. Closes up nicely. It's a nice clean car. I'm up in uh, Pennsylvania at the moment. Our dealership's in Bel Air, Maryland, which is about 20 miles north of uh, Baltimore. But uh, I come up here to the some of the small towns in Pennsylvania and I get some trade-ins from new car dealers and that's what this is. Now uh, this is from a, a rural um, community called York. It has the extreme package and also has uh, uh, wheels and tires on it. Uh, let's see the size of these tires are let's see here. I don't have to know that. These are 20 inch tires and they're low profiles. They ride a little more stout but still rides nice and uh, look great. Here the motor sounds good. The air conditioning is cold. Has a 4.3 V6. That's a good looking car though. And if you're looking for something a little special with a lot of life left in it for a cheap price, this blazer will be for you. Got a scratch on the hood. Nothing terrible can be uh, uh, you know, you can dab a little touch-up paint on that and be fine with it. Tires are in good shape and these are expensive tires. The radio, I cannot get to work. I uh, see speakers in the back. has a remote with the radio here. It's a JVC CD player, but um, uh, I cannot get that to operate. The air is cold. The windows have a little tint on them. Definitely a head turning car though. Sounds nice too. two little chips in the windshield that have been repaired so I think they'll be fine See all the gauges look good and uh, no warning lights. The Blazer is a nice size vehicle. It's an SUV, but it's a six cylinder, but it's not doesn't cost a lot to keep on the road. Yet it's got enough power when you want to go. Shifts through all the gears. Now this is a no reserve auction, so don't bid on the auction. Let's see how rural we are. There's some cows. Um, no reserve auction, so don't bid on it unless you're able to finish the transaction. 
We will pick you up at the airport if you're coming from far away. Come to Baltimore Washington International Airport, train station or bus station. And people do that all the time. We're not in a very rust prone area. So people from the Northeast or Midwest where they use a lot of salt come all the time to buy some of these older, cheaper vehicles. Well, I took it up to around 50, but I, I've had up to 60, 65, runs fine on the highway. So she will drive you home wherever you need to go. And you're going style with these wheels, tires, the ground effects, and the sunroof. It'll just make a nice little car. sitting here at the red light. Like I said, I come up uh, once a week to get some trade-ins from the new car dealers, some of these small new car dealers, and get some really clean, nice vehicles that tend to be well-maintained. And uh, I think that's what this one is. So, um, anyhow, if you're looking for a cheap, good car, head turner, buy this blazer.